Hey everyone. In this video, we're going to create this beautiful apple sleek kind of landing page in very simple steps. Select the artboard and change the color to black. Then go to Google and search for your reference. I'm taking this one. Then create one rectangle. Add radius to 25 and add fill to linear gradient and choose the color that you liked. Then select the border and change it to white and reduce the opacity and turn on both sides. Then we can add our necessary item like chip, Wi-Fi and card number so on. Then create one small rectangle and make it radius 12. We no need border. Then duplicate the same shape and turn on opposite like remove the fill and the border and resize it. Then follow my design pattern. Then we can group it and we can push on top of the chip like this. Then we can mask with a shape. You could see now we have created beautiful chip design and make sure all of them in a single group. Then simply we can drag and drop our logo and Wi-Fi symbol. Then add little more detail to the card. What we could do here, we'll just add one small circle and we can use repeated grid to make some pattern like this. Again, make sure all of them in single group. For the last detail, uh, we could copy the same, the background card one more time. Then remove the border and change the color to white. Then resize like this. We'll keep only that one corner as a radius and we can make it other is in a zero. Then double click the rectangle, you could see that all edges as visible now. We can select this edge and hit the delete. Then reduce the opacity. So you could see some reflection effect now. So what we could do, we can resize it and we can adjust the corner like this. Then we can group it.
the same way we can create the back side as well Once we created our both cards, just select the first one and turn on the 3D transform. Then add value here to 1 and the back side here minus 1, minus 180. I will tell you why we are doing it this later. Then simply group together and position like this. Then simply drag and drop your logo and hamburger. the grid so we can align properly then add your big block text this is our main content Then go to object, path, convert to path. The moment you given, your property has been gone here. So you can't able to change the text anymore. This is a one drawback in XD. Now, but simply you can add the gradient color that you liked. Then the select the artboard and duplicate it and click the card one as 3D transform. You could see there is a middle icon. You can click that it can drag it then you can resize it like this and align like this. Then simply delete this and copy paste the first design to here and uh, you can push it like this and make it a bit smaller and align. Then duplicate the artwork and push all the content little above and bit smaller then align the card also center of the artboard then tilt a bit like this And you can arrange all the text and the card also center of the artboard. Now we can go back to artboard one and we can add prototype. His auto animate easy in out. 
the time this is the most important thing we need to consider this is the way that magic is happening so you can experiment with the value that you liked i am using 4 second this artboard to this artboard you can add time now we can view our prototype that's it guys we have created some beautiful transition animation Now simply we can duplicate the artboard too. Then push the element little app. Just drag and drop our content. and just align it center just copy paste the same text to the outboard then prototype you could see the text animations also happening together then duplicate the artboard and select the card and rotate like this you remember i have told before so here the place we going to animate it this card basically we have a two design so select the back side and change the value to 1 and here to 0 then select that first design and add value minus 1 then align properly then push it up the text like this now go back to that first artboard add the prototype but there is a slightly problem here you could see that card is not flipping properly because we have forgotten one value just go back here and add this value at 180 Now again check it. Now working properly. That's it guys. You have created some beautiful landing page design. You can create the whole website like using this tips and trick. Thank you.